And anti-aging could be a side effect of Bitcoin. The reason is that many of the cryptocurrency billionaires have been investing a lot into anti-aging, not just um, slowing aging, but the actual reversal of aging. And there are now hundreds of companies pursuing anti-aging aging reversal. One of the most interesting ones is being founded by one of the, uh, the founders of um, Coinbase, uh, Brian Armstrong. And he's put over, he's worth over $10 billion and he's put $105 million into his new company, New Limit. And it's gonna focus on epigenetics. So epigenetics is the, um, it's changing the methylation groups so that you can activate and deactivate genes. So you don't have to resequence the genes yourself, you just change the activations, which could be a shortcut to faster gene editing aging reversal. Another um, anti-aging aging reversal leader is George Church, who founded multiple billion dollar companies, Editas Medicine, which is, does a lot of uh, gene editing with CRISPR. He's you know, a giant in the field. And, um, and so he's got a company that's gonna be working on a combination gene therapies to reverse aging. His company is, um, sorry, just, uh, is uh, <clears throat> Rejuvenate Bio. Timelines might, might flip a bit, but he's working on dog anti-aging, age reversal, which would be a $70 billion business, and then generate the funds, FDA approval, prove out the techniques, and then apply those into humans. And, <clears throat> and so then we'll be able to reverse many of the, the aging damage that we have to get really long lives. <clears throat>